Welcome to another league match against Terry Pierce. Let's see what we have here. Um, <laughs> no trashing. I don't see any trashing. A legionary treasure troll thing might be good. You could also open leprechaun and gain early golds for legionary. I definitely don't want to contest settlers if he goes for wild hunt. Yeah, add some sellers. Maybe a capital. I think I open Leprechaun Silver. Let me drink some tea. This was a match on short notice here. Yeah, Leprechaun here does the same thing. Oh, I hit six here. But I don't think I get gold because I get gold from Leprechaun. That's why I think I get a Legionary. Uh, I could also get a Capital, but I think getting the attack in first is more important. Um, Road Network might play a role here. This is a seller. Miserable. Uh, I can live with miserable. Uh, I think this is another legionary here. I already have two terminals. Yeah, but I definitely need sec two sec uh, two legionaries, and I can get the treasure trove later if I need to be. Yeah, legionary. Uh, here's a legionary in here, but not a gold. He gets a legionary here, I assume. Treasury. I don't understand treasury at all. Um, let's see, how many cards do I discard to seller? I think I just discard all but the Leprechaun and hope to not draw the Legionary and hope to draw the Legionary with the gold next turn. That's unfortunate, but... Now let's play legionary and get a treasure trove. Ah, he has caravan guard in hand. That's unfortunate. Oh, he has 11. Does he go already for province here? Capital now, yeah. So I think I get a capital here now as well. Oh, uh, now I just buy gold here, I think. Oh, I could buy a road network. How good is road network? I think it's pretty good. Let's buy it. I think it's pretty good. Especially if he decides to buy legionary at some point. So this is province.
And I gain a gold, which is excellent. I might buy a third legionary. Curse, excellent. There you go, there is the legionary. Uh, I'd rather not play the leprechaun. I think it, I discarded. I should be able to get province or something. I don't understand treasury and artificer. Artificer can gain like settlers, which is, uh, settlers are nice, but I don't think it's really worth it. He hit seven. I kind of wish he hit, hit eight so that he can buy a province so that I can draw a card here. Oh, he buys road network as well. Excellent. Unfortunately, only seven though. <clears throat> um, I'm thinking gold or legionary. I think I could get a third legionary here. Ah, uh, now I wish I would have bought gold so that I can get a legionary here. But I think I get a capital here. Oh, well. This is awkward. Uh, Karen got then here. Although he doesn't seem to go for wild hunt. Uh, anyway, so I might buy a settlers. Settlers or Caravan Guard better. He still has only one Legionary. So activating Caravan Guard is not that likely. Settlers is also better if is also if if a legionary attacks me, uh, I have coppers and discards to activate settlers. A seller is also reasonable. I think I have only one. No, I think I think I still get the caravan guard. Okay, this is province. Okay, he gets a province as well, I assume, here. Um, this means I draw a card. Oh, excellent! <laughs> Thank you, Road Network. It already paid off. Wow, that was awesome. Um, do, I, do I take one dead... And get a settlers here. Uh, 
I don't think it's worth it, is it? No, I think it's not worth it. Oh, I'm glad I didn't. Another attack in. Excellent. Third province. Oh, and this is another province unless he attacks me here. Although with Karen God, I have a reasonable chance. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, I have to discard the gold, unfortunately. But I still hit province, right? The leprechaun is inconsequential here. But at least I don't draw it next turn and I have province in hand. It's not, uh, it might be not too bad. Uh, I think I buy a state with two provinces left. And I won't, I will see the estate at max one time. Although it gives him a card. Oh, wow. Can he win here? Wow! Come on! Unbelievable! That was a nut draw! Uh, yeah, that was indeed a bit lucky. Oops. Uh, he was first player. <laughs> wow. Double province turn. Well, the miserable hurt because I lost because of the miserable. Unbelievable. I hope I am not tilting now next games. Pouch. Canal. Can you do things with Canal? Hermit can gain four costs, which is not really helpful because Nomad Camp Skull Potion is not something you want in masses. <clears throat> Um, that's familiar. I think Guildhall is really good here. You want a skull, you want familiars, you want catapults. You want hermit. So I hope uh, hermit potion doesn't it make it that likely to hit free potion? <clears throat> I don't think Canal plays a big role here because it will take forever to hit 7. Castles don't play a role because you will never get to the expensive ones here. Um, if you trash down Coin of the Helm... Coin of the Realm, Wild Hound, Enshin seems good. Can you ignore Familiar and open Catapult Hermit? Hermit trashing estates, gaining silvers, Catapult trashing coppers, letting him discard and preventing him getting Familiar. I think that seems reasonable, especially me as first player.
It also makes it more likely that I hit five early, which will be amazing. I think I just get one Hermit to Trash Estates, gain Silvers. Uh, that enables me to hit five. And get Guild Hall. And with Catapult and Rocks, I get lots of a uh, Guild Hall coffers. And... I'm not sure if, if I can give him enough curses fast enough so before he can give me a familiar. The upside of this, I will be trashed down and uh, then I can build a Wild Hunt Coin of the Realm engine with one Skulk and one Pouch as plus buys. He opens Skull Hermit. I haven't even considered that. That makes it also... You have a decent chance to hit Guild Hall that way. Um, I think this is another Catapult. And I'm not gaining go Silvers with Hermit. I think I gain Coin of the Realms. Discard a card. Well, I'm gaining one silver for sure here. I want to hit Guildhall and buy a coin of the realm. From discard trashing is strictly better. Silver, coin of the realm. Uh, I don't hit five here. I'm playing Catapult here because I don't have an estate to trash. And it might prevent him getting a familiar. He gets another Skulk? Wow, okay. <clears throat> uh, I think I get a third Catapult here. Again, four, it's really unfortunate. I mean, not that unlikely, but still unfortunate. Uh, I think I just get two coin of the realms here. <clears throat> Discard down to three cards. Come on. <clears throat> I think I attack him here. Uh, all I want is him preventing to get familiar. And he needs four cards most likely to get... Okay, there's another coin of the realm. I think I spam those now. And he gets another familiar here. Okay, Hermit. Treasure state from... the discard uh, I get another catapult so that I win the split and I think a silver uh, I wish I already had guild hall one two three four five this is guild hall now finally Although a wild hunt would be amazing too. But... I could have trashed the silver to give him a curse. No, but I think I get guild hall and now spam rocks. There's a curse. I have to consider getting a madman. 
I definitely attack him here as well. I don't want him to get a second fam oh, he gets a madman here. I don't want him getting a second familiar or guild hall or something really good. Uh silver or coin. How many coins do I have on the mat? I already have four coins on the mat. Uh I think I don't need more. Uh I think this is a silver. It gives me a coffer. And buys. This is excellent if I don't get attacked here. He gets Wild Hunt over Guild Hall. So catapult the copper. This is a rocks here for me. When you gain or trash this, gain a silver. Yeah, this is two coffers here for me. Uh, call, hermit, trash curse. More silvers. Can deny coins. If he goes for wild hunt, but I th still think now giving him curses is superior, so I think silver is better and rocks. So I have four coin tokens. I trashed a catapult, ugh, but I'm really thin. Shouldn't hurt that much. Let's trash silver. Give him a curse. Call that trash a copper. I think I get all the rocks and then get wild hunts. Oh, wow. <laughs> I didn't know that I have that high of uh, action density, uh, uh, money density. I guess I get canal here. I need a skulk soon as well. Uh, I'd forgotten how effective catapult can be. I think it just came up on boards that didn't suit it for a long time for me. Oh, Hermit can gain me a Skulk here. I will do that. No, Trash is another Catapult. Oh, I have only one Catapult left, I think. Ugh. Maybe I don't prioritize Rocks now and instead go for Wild Hunt now. Ugh. Really unfortunate. And I hope he doesn't get the coin here because I kind of want it myself. Oh, I gained a tracker from Trash and Catapult because it was the only option. Fair enough. Definitely not trashing the tracker though. Definitely trashing the estate. Gaining a skulk. Another coffer, rocks, coin here. Um, I think I spend one coffer, get rocks, coin. Oh, madman gives me a curse, skulk. Oh, that is brutal envious here. 
But I should be still winning. I would have bought a province here. Although, my, maybe it's nice that I don't buy a province. I get a wild hunt here. <clears throat> but Guildhall is really amazing with all the rocks and coin of the realm and skull gaining gold. You gain so much treasure cards and treasure cards are really good here. What is he waiting for? Oh, to discard. I, I only accounted for the curse. I forgot that he has also to discard. Yeah, getting a curse and having to discard like each turn is really brutal. Uh, but I'm really sad about losing two catapults. It makes it really hard to trash down now. This is wild hunt for me. He goes for castles. This seems like a measure of last resort here. Although the piles are kind of low. I'm getting another wild hunt here. Although, no, I'm just definitely getting a province here with one buy. Do I have a Plus buy? No. Oh, uh, I can top deck. No, 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 thanks. I don't think I have coppers left. Wow, he hits eight? Well, he had two wild hunts here. Um, amazing. I'm getting another wild hunt here, I think. Crashing the curse. Um, What do I get here? Nomad camp? I kind of want another plus buy, although I have two buy plus buys already. I'm not sure if I want a silver. Silver is just, but I get a coffer if I get a silver. Yeah, I think I get a silver. Um, here I'm gaining Madman, I think. Wild Hunts are running. Uh, I need to maybe stop getting them, but I think I get one more. <sighs> Definitely not getting the last rocks. I think I get a madman here. Um, don't trash. Getting another skull seems good. And end buys. And now I'm just running provinces. I have 13 coffers. Here with two buys, I think I spent eight coffers to get double province. He gives me a curse. He only got one familiar, yeah, that's 
he definitely needed more familiars to be able to. So I think I get spent eight coffers here. Oh, undo. Uh, I forgot canal. So six coffers. Oh, madman. That's brutal. How many coins are I have free on the mat? Oh, I only have like two or three wild hunts. <sighs> How many curses are in the trash? Three. So that means he has three curses, I think, because I don't think I have one. Oh, he will attack me here. It's unfortunate. I think I just got two silvers. Unless, oh yeah, unless he treasures a curse. I was just going to say that. Nice. It would have hurt to have to discard here. Going a copper onto your deck. That hurts. Gets the province. Seven. Wow. Okay, nice. <clears throat> Catapult on rocks, give him another curse. Wait, why do I have six cards in hand? I don't understand. I must be missing something. He gains another curse. Oh, can I win here? I don't have enough buys. Uh, I think I get double province here. The canal was also nice and lucky. Saved me so much, and uh, I could get in skulks and so on. Does he try to curse or attack me? With the wild hunt, it doesn't hurt me that much that I get attacked. I think I discard the tracker if I get attacked because it doesn't do me a whole lot of good and a copper is kind of better to have but he tries as a curse okay guild hall was just the winner here I wish I could have gotten it earlier Oh, uh, I have to discard anyway. Yeah, track a copper. Dutchy. I have 10 point lead still. Wild hunt, cards. Coin, wild hunt, cards. Tracker. Uh, my discard pile is empty, it's unfortunate. Yeah, I spend one coffer to get a province. No, I'm not top decking it. Twelve point lead, I just need to get a province. Uh, if I trash the Skulk... Wait, I can win by 
um, trashing Skulk, I give him a curse. And then I just need to buy Rock's Curse, right? Yeah. Game free. So there's Lab and Haunted Woods that makes University really good, and also Sentry and Treasurer and Crown. Yeah, University is an all star here. Um, you can't trash. This makes Haunted Woods really good. Oh, the Sentry. Never mind. Um. <laughs> Yeah, you want to open potion. Oh, there's bonfire as well. Uh, <clears throat> I think I open bonfire potion. Hope to get not one one in a potion. And get like two sentries and then labs, crowns, haunted woods, treasurer. Yeah, that's really good. Sad that I'm not first player here. This can really make a difference. <laughs> Treasure map may play a role later. Wait, is there a plus buy? A pawn is plus buy. So. Okay, I have two estates here. This means I hit university. Unfortunately, it's not in the shuffle. But for him, it's, it's either fool's gold? Can be nice. Do I bonfire again? I really don't need any money. University can give me a s treasurer first, maybe. And get the key. Can we get me treasure maps? Uh, yeah, let's bonfire again. Nice, I have university here. I have only seven cards in my deck. He has university, but I'm thinner. I drew it immediately. Unfortunately, here is not my second university. That's unfortunate. Um... So do I get Sentry first or Treasurer just to hit, be able to get the key early and get another University? I think I get the Treasurer first. Oh, uh, this is a Pawn. Um, <clears throat> this is buy card. He just really goes for fool's gold. I don't want to get that. This is sentry. He hasn't played his university yet, right? Yeah, amazing. Um, buy card. Treasurer. I think I just take the key here. And get Pawn University. No, I just trashed the copper. Hmm. No, I take the key. It's really good. University Pawn. Here I trash a copper. 
Although I can't, I have the key. So yeah, I hit lab. Uh, although Crown seems also really good, Crown University. Crown a century. <clears throat> I don't get his fool's gold. So now I will get two labs here. That's really unfortunate. Come on. Ugh. I think I discard them. Lab, lab, university. Wow, he really overpaid for that university. Sentry, trash, confirm discarding, lab, university, lab, university, lab. <clears throat> Pawn is by card, lab, treasurer, trash that copper. Um, get university pawn. Do I crown the sentry? I have to, right? Because I need to find my labs. He gets haunted woods now. Fair enough. Crown my. Sentry, confirm trashing, confirm discarding. Although I should have discarded the treasurer. Yeah, I should have. No. Um, I think I discard the po I trash the potion here. I don't think I need more universities really. Although it gives me end game control, uh, but lab, 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 card buy, lab, treasure. He resigns. Okay. Yeah, the fo those fools goals just were on. Really un weird. I'm first player. Ready. Okay, barracks. At the start of your turn, plus one action. Oh, I don't think we need that with page here. <clears throat> wow, this is a power board. Let's see. Let's see, really powerful cards. There's check, there's magpie, there's royal carriage, there's seer, there's chapel, there's page. Transmute and philosopher's stone are ignorable. Bureaucrat is ignorable. Contraband is not ignorable because it's the only way of plus buy. <clears throat> but you open Chapel Page, right? And hope to trash his warrior with your warrior.
be right back. Okay, I'm back. Oh, he has 5-2 and opens contraband. Well, I'm denying chapel for sure. Uh, page for sure. Although, hmm. Yeah, uh, I opened chapel. Oh, uh, contraband is really nice opening. He can just ignore page and go straight for palace points with magpie. But it's a colony board, I don't know. Page. Oh, let's hope that I draw the chapel here. Otherwise I have to trash five coppers, f uh, four coppers next turn. And let's hope that chapel is not the last card in the deck. That would be even worse. Come on, Chapel. Sad. But Page. I get silvers, so it doesn't really hurt that much. He has a page now. Okay. I'm still denying page here, right? Magpie is really good. Uh, here I trash only a state and get a magpie. So let's see. I still want him deny pages, right? Seems still best. 
Seer probably for him. Yeah. There goes his treasure, treasure hunter. Nice. Okay. <clears throat> I still, I think I just get platinum here. Or contraband. Uh, I think I get the contraband here. I need a plus buy. Yeah, because uh, I have always good time. I can get magpie or carrot seer. Although magpies, I really don't want to buy. I want to gain them. I can get more pages and attack him more. Trash his magpies. Yeah, let's get contraband. Uh, da -da -da. Exchange. Although hero could have gained me contraband. Although a second contraband. Do I want a second contraband? He doesn't get a magpie here. <clears throat> Barracks is un unneeded. How do I... It's weird. I have nine and there's platinum on the board, but I get a contraband instead. Uh, Hero gain gains me a platinum here then. And I buy a seer, I think. Although royal carriage. Uh, can I? Auto play options are off. Okay. Seer with magpie is just bonkers. Let's see what his stack is look, looks like. He has two magpies, a seer. He has six, six cards left. A chapel. A contraband. Two estates, which he trashed. I still want him not get pages. There was a copper there. He has like nearly no money. Okay. Hero gained platinum. And with seven I get a seer. Magpie again don't duplicate because his deck is too thin, which is amazing because I want them. Treasure treasures of cobble. Okay, I know he he has two cards left here. <clears throat> One is a silver. I think this through real quick. What is this other card? Is this a copper? It might be a copper and then he buys gold. 
I'm fine with him buying gold. I think I'm still denying Paige. Yeah, he gets gold. Okay. Uh, champion, please. Uh, I don't think I play this warrior. Even though it can trash a magpie or something. I want champion to hit... Um, Champion, not to tra tra draw the champion dead. Oh, champion is here. I know here it's here. Okay, then definitely not play warrior. And actions contraband. Let's see what he denies me. Platinum. That's weird. Okay. I think I get C or page. Definitely want another page because I want more warriors. And Seer is just really good. Magpie again doesn't trigger. So he has Chapel. Which he doesn't play. And then gold, silver, copper, magpie. So free. I could deny platinum now because he can buy platinum, right? Do I care if he gets a platinum? He has nine. Um, I think I still deny Paige here. If he gets a platinum. He can try to raise me with colonies, but I will just name colony from now on then. I think I will name page and next turn, if he gets platinum, next turn name colony. Yeah, platinum. Okay. Champion. I think I get another seer here. And he draws his deck and doesn't get magpies. Oh, this is amazing. <clears throat> yeah. And, uh... Oh, he treasures his copper? That's three points. Ah, uh, he just gets a platinum instead. Okay. So, a uh, magpie first. Oh, I draw a silver. Uh, magpie. Wow. Come on, magpie. I want you to duplicate. Uh, page. Seer. So, <laughs> Warrior. Uh, I don't care for palace points, so chapel, the copper, and actions. I could just get colony each turn now. Oh, 
Or do I play contraband and get two ancient pieces again? I can't underestimate that he gets colony each turn. He has still two magpies which draws him amazingly and unfortunately I couldn't trash one. I get it. I kind of want more pages still. <clears throat> That's a tough choice. But I think I do that. Keep, exchange. Nice. Oh, here comes another magpie for him, which is really good for him. Yeah, I'm worried here. <clears throat> Quest. So I'm starting player. So if we get a colony each turn, we tie. I need him to dart. Why two silvers? Oh, he gained magpie. Okay. There's another magpie. Great. Uh, I only got one magpie. There is a trashed magpie. He still has two though. And he discarded a platinum. So I think I play contraband here. 10, 15, 18, 19. Yeah, I play contraband here. If he denies me colony, I get double province. If he denies me province, I get colony plus. He names Colony. Okay, I think I get our province here then. Keep, exchange. Ooh. Oh, that's scary. He gains another magpie. But he's unlikely because Platinum is, is in discard to find uh, definitely Colony. But it's, I don't think he has enough for Colony here. He would have, but not without the contraband. Okay. <clears throat> he just gets Province and Duchy. Oh, I don't like the Duchy. He will stall so hard. 
Uh, yeah, just buying province here. He gets a magpie? No, no, he gets another magpie. Please let me get a magpie here. Colony for sure. Province, okay. I'm still in the lead. Magpie, give me a magpie. Oh, okay. Seer. Nice magpie. So that's the last magpie. Okay. Um. Now I play Seer because Magpie wants me. I want to draw with Magpie. Um, done ordering. Warrior. Trash is a Magpie. Nice. Seer. Um, warrior. Doesn't matter. <clears throat> yeah, I think I play Contraband here. If he denies me Colony, I get double province and be pretty safe to win. <clears throat> if he denies me province, I get Colony plus. He should deny me province here. Yeah. Colony. <clears throat> I don't like the duchy. I could get gold. No, that doesn't that that isn't enough for double colony. <clears throat> I think I just get another seer. Royal carriage is also nice, so that I can play warrior twice. But it's a little bit scary if I draw royal carriage in the starting hand. Um Yeah, let's still get Royal Carriage. Keep, keep, execute. Nice. This is excellent. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. He just doesn't have enough money now, I think. Okay, he can buy colony. Okay, a uh, royal carriage. Warrior. Treasure the magpie, excellent. Treasures a magpie. <clears throat> yeah, I think I do the same thing. Contraband. He has to deny province.
I don't like that warrior treasures free or false. Seems like better sign for a travel. I guess getting more than page ensures against it. But it seems to make Sergio much narrow, like urchin or something. Here, names province. Okay. Again, colony. Um, second royal carriage seems too risky to me. So I think I just get another seer here. Keep, keep. How many? Oh, wow. Um, four magpies are in the trash. Royal carriage, magpie. Reveals magpie. Okay, I have to do that. Whew, that was close. Discards province. Seer first. Done ordering. Oh, I... No, let's do that differently. That was close. What is the last card here? A colony, right? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, he's just lost now. No way he can win. What did I did I trash something? Platinum and Condorman. Colony Seer again, I think. I have a big point lead. I uh, I don't need Dutchy. Province, Royal Carriage, Seer, Seer, Magpie, Magpie, oh, it's fine, I have eight. GG. <clears throat> Another colony game. This is a crazy engine. There's menagerie, encampment, and city for draw. Um, I kind of am tempted to open double forager, get all the encampments. <clears throat> Horse rate is also nice. 
but doesn't work with forage uh, as well. But horse traders can give me five and two buys. This is like menagerie encampment or fishing village encampment or something. <clears throat> but menagerie is really good here because even if you have duplicates, you can uh, duplicate coppers, you can play them, get villa, and continue to draw. So. Um, <clears throat> How do you build this? I kind of want also gold early so that my encampments aren't dead. I think I opened double forager anyway. Oh, I can't. Hmm, that's interesting. He dressed in a state. I think I have to trash a copper first and then an estate so that I can buy an encampment. And then I have four or five next turn. I have five, but all I want is basically a menagerie. Yeah, this is another menagerie for me here. My two estates are here not to trash to forager, which is sad. He gets throne room. <clears throat> Double encampment. Oh, this is amazing. Five and three buys. <clears throat> I don't think I need throne rooms yet. I think this is just menagerie encampment here. If I would have had six, I would have bought a gold. Move down then doesn't really matter because the point swing is much bigger than those points can get you. I mean, it will matter maybe in the end game. Oh, I can maybe get a plunder here. This is a really unfortunate hand. Come on. Menagerie. He should get a gold or a plunder. He gets a gold. Forager here, menagerie. I can't, uh, I can't get villa here. I don't want to play encampment. I don't want to play encampment. Oh!
So I need money now. What are the last three cards? Can I... <clears throat> Can I get a plunder here? I think this is our free menageries or something. <clears throat> oh, I need to make a quick break again. And I'm back. <clears throat> okay, um, if this is a copper, this is important to know. So I opened up a forager in Cartman. One menagerie, two menageries, three menageries. Four menageries. I think this is a copper. Oh no! There's another encampment in there. Uh, okay. Yeah, this was bad. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this was bad. I screwed that up. Let's get a horse traders. I think I'm behind. He keeps his encampment, which is amazing for him. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm so behind. He can get another encampment and this is really good for him. He draws his deck and he has a gold. At least he can't get a plunder, but he can oh uh, maybe I mean he can get encampment plunder most likely. So eight, yeah, this is encampment plunder for him, I assume, yeah. So my menagerie plan has to work out. This is basically the whole goal of that. So this is plunder for me.
Oh, he has to set a, a set an encampment aside. <clears throat> so I want villas and horse traders now, so that I can discard and redraw, discard and redraw. This should give me all the money that I need. He's so far ahead. He should get like villa, menagerie, menagerie or something. Villa Menagerie Horse Traders. Oh, I don't like another plunder. He has already two throne room. I'm not a big fan either. He needs to increase. I mean, plunder increases his money, but yeah. Uh... Okay, encampment. Reveal. Horse Traders. This menagerie forager, the forager. <clears throat> I can't get I think this is horse traders encampment here. I need money. Ooh. <clears throat> Do I play an encampment blind here? I have a 40% chance that I find a plunder. I think I play one menagerie and if I still can't find it, I play encampment, then I have 50% chance. He definitely needs... Oh, I don't like that. Okay, nice. Okay, horse traders. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> so I want more horse traders, more menageries, more villages. Um. Definitely a horse traders, but because I need the money. <clears throat> and a villa, maybe? I can play this. Doesn't help me all that much. I could get an estate trash to Forager. I 
could get Villa Menagerie. Kind of want the horse traders though. But Villa Menagerie would give me. Or Villa Fishing Village. Yeah, let's do Villa Fishing Village. <laughs> Definitely want another horse race. Now throne rooms are nice and menageries. I have enough actions now. I think menageries, horse raiders, and throne room are my goal for this turn. But I'm still behind. I hope he has a dot turn with all the money that is in his deck. But he still draws everything back up. He has two golds, a plunder, two plunders, 14, three buys. He definitely needs Villa now. <clears throat> he has only one menagerie. Menagerie and Wolf Den doesn't work well together. <laughs> I have minus seven points. Bishop? What? What? Two bishops? Am I missing something? That seems terrible. There's no way to gain stuff. Especially on a colony board, it seems like really terrible. I don't understand. He had such a big lead and now he throws it away. He can just get villa menageries and horse traders and get his draw engine up. And get all the money he needs. Get one platinum. Or maybe two platinum for the wolf then. <clears throat> What's he what is he going to trash to Bishop? Villa? What? No. I don't understand. Okay, fishing village, villa, horse traders, forager, villa, menagerie, uh, horse traders. Encampment Villa Menagerie Villa I don't even need to play the encampments <clears throat> Let's play yeah, if I play Encampment, Encampment, then play Plunder, I can buy Villa and then play the Forager for one extra coin. So let's do that. 
encampment, plunder, encampment, plunder, and actions, plunder. Okay, so I want, yeah, I think, oh, I could have, oh, that was stupid. I could have, uh, that was stupid of me. I could have gotten horse traders, villa or something, and get, get extra coins that way. I have to be careful next time. Villa is so tricky. Okay. Um, I don't think I need throne room yet. Definitely get horse traders. Villa, Villa, Forager. Menagerie. And then I think I get something to trash to Forager. I have a, a fishing village here. Okay, I have to be careful. If I draw, if I have drawn my deck, I can play Villa and continue on with the turn. <clears throat> Bishop. Yeah, well, a forager he can trash. That's fine. Don't trash. It's like the only card he can trash, though. Oh, stall turn. Maybe he can villa and then menagerie. If he has a menagerie. Bishop, I don't understand that. Okay. Horse traders, villa encampment, menagerie. Nice encampment, reveal plunder, menagerie. Uh, <clears throat> villa. Horse traders, forager, copper, menagerie, horse traders, villa, plunder, menagerie, villa, menagerie. So now I can.
Well, I will definitely forage the copper. Oh, I should have, I shouldn't still have done that. I could have gotten horse traders and discard those to redraw. Villa. And actions. <clears throat> so let's get platinum villa. Definitely want more menageries. I think I just want all the menageries. Although I kind of... Maybe menagerie, menagerie fishing village. <clears throat> I don't want him getting cities. And I rather buy the copper in the villa turn uh, if, uh, when I, yeah, I think I stop here and buys. So two piles are low. I think I get colonies now. Those bishop buys though, oh man, he could have won easily and now those bishop points doesn't don't matter with colony on the board and there's no way to gain stuff. I might get a second platinum here. Throne room is not all that great because you don't kind of want to throne Menagerie. Okay, he gets the last menagerie. Uh, you kind of don't want to throw menagerie. Throwing villa and fishing village is also not great.
so okay And actions. I can just get double colony here. But I think it's better to get colony platinum. Yeah, this doesn't work. Um. I have to be careful not to let him pile out. If I get Platinum Villa, that's 13, I have 9 left. I can get Platinum Platinum Villa. And can still buy Colony. Platinum, Platinum, Villa is exactly 22. I get Villa in hand. Play Villa, play Manager, it's draw two. Yeah, I'm doing that. Platinum, Platinum, Villa, Villa, Menagerie, and Actions, Colony. I have free platinum now, now, but I should have enough horse traders to discard um, the platinum. He can't pile out, right? Yeah. I'm granting him, but... Uh, does he get plunder first now? Uh, colony Villa, okay. Doesn't make a difference. He bishops the colony, maybe? Precious Menagerie, what? Okay. So his deck is like really bad now. I should be winning here.
So let's last card is Forager. This is okay. So I do Villa. Villa. I don't play the plunder, right? Uh, let's let's calculate first. I have 31. Well, I just play the encampment, play the plunder, and get free colonies. I don't think I want to do more villa tricks. 18, 28, 33. Um, wolf Den. Let's, let me think about Wolf Den. I only have one plunder. Where do I got... Oh, from Plunder. Okay. Um... <clears throat> I have only one forager. Not a whole lot I can do about that. Yeah, I don't want to top deck the forager. Okay, nice. I have fishing villages. No? I hope I draw a villa or something. I can also play encampments blind. I'm still mad about the first game that I lost this one. Double capital. And I'm back. <clears throat> so what did he do? Just bought two cities. Wow, okay.
Nice. So I have three platinum and four colonies. Nice. I should be able oh, to win. I didn't draw menagerie. Dang it. I think Colony Plunder. Wait, can I? I can pile out. <laughs> I uh, Thanks for saying GG because I uh, wouldn't have noticed that. Um, wait, can I pile, pile out? 12? So, last game, I'm first player, ready. Ah, uh, yeah, his bishops lost him the game. I, I don't understand why he bought bishops. Okay, um, experiments are draw. That's the only draw as experiments. And with Swindler. I still think this is like a money ish board because there's no way to trash and with Soothsayer and Swindler. <clears throat> I think I want to open double terminal here, double Swindler because of Arena. I'm not sure if I buy experiment or chair race for free. Oh, he has five two. Will he get a druid? Let's see. Okay, the silver is not too bad. So they collide, unfortunately. So do I get experiment or chair race or oasis here? Vessel is not good. Mining village might be good. But not really. I think experiment here. Oh, they don't collide, but. He gets chariot race. Oh. That is too bad. Well, that is maybe game winning for me. <laughs> Hitting his soothsayer.
Here I'm not playing experiment, I'm just getting a soothsayer. I can lost arts experiments. I'll just gain a gold. Five one again. Yeah, it looks like I'm um, uh, again uh, promoting to see. And yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.